So hello guys, welcome back to the channel. I hope you all are absolutely fine and sound and many of you have multiple questions that dark it facilitated cohort to enrollments are closed. Can we still earn the swags and earn exciting goodies? So in this video, I'll cover this topic. And first of all, if you're new to this channel, do like the video and subscribe the channel because we produce such kind of content and help you to learn about cloud and many more exciting events. So just subscribe the channel. Now let's get started. So basically here you can clearly see that the Arcade Facilitator Program Cohort 2 enrollments were closed already around 13th or 11th of August, I think so. So now you cannot participate in the Arcade Facilitator Program. But you must be aware that the Arcade Program has two options. Basically, the Arcade Program is the program which is owned by again Google Cloud team. And here you can see this is our arcade homepage and here games are hosted each month and it has two cohort cohort 1 and cohort 2 so cohort 1 already ended in June itself now the cohort 2 started from July itself I know many of you have completed the July badges also so here we'll talk about it but many of you are confused that the enrollment form for the arcade facilitator program has been closed so can we again take part and win swags so yes the answer is simple yes because the Arcade Facilitator program was just a, you can say just a mediator to help you earn more points. That means if you haven't participated in the Arcade Facilitator program, then also you are eligible for the swags. And if you have participated in the Arcade Facilitator program, then also you have to reach particular milestone to achieve the swags. Basically, these milestones are not based on the point system which you see over here. The arcade milestones will be updated soon on the arcade homepage. So I will show you a rough idea like what can be the milestone points etc. And it may increase or decrease. We need to wait for the official update also. So this will be a sample hint. So basically here you can see. If you have not participated in the arcade facilitator program. But if you have participated in the arcade facilitator program. For that I have already made a video. You can just check out this playlist. And here, wait a second, I think the video is playing. Let me show you. Wait for a second, come over here to the playlist section. And here you can just view the complete playlist. Okay, so here you can see all the video about LAFRI courses, your progress reports, how to just complete the pre-assessment skill badges and all these things like the facilitator guide, how to just earn the points, all things are covered over here and how to just redeem your credits i'm just not repeating it again and again here you can see the point systems are also here okay here you can see the laugh solutions and basically this video is regarding the point system so if you want clarification regarding the point system mentioned for the arcade facilitator program you can check that video in this video we'll specifically talk about the arcade program so basically we can ignore this point system and lab courses. So first thing you need to understand that in the arcade program, the program started from, as I said earlier, from the July and will be ending on December. So here for the arcade facilitator program, it will be ending on 6th of October. So you have time till that only to earn the bonus points. So if you have participated in the arcade facilitator program, hurry up, complete the arcade games. If you have completed the arcade games, go to the trivia and skill badges section. And for skill badges also, I will share the master sheet. Do not worry about it. So basically, here we are talking about the arcade program. Here you can see each month delivery games. So basically for the arcade program, uh, you have to just collect the badges. And at last these badges can be used to redeem the swags. So for that you need to understand the arcade point system. It is totally different from the arcade facilitator point system. Here you can see for each game we get one arcade point. Whether it's level 1, level 2, level 3 or base camp or certification zone. Okay. Now, similarly for the trivia also. Now, here is the catch. Just like the point system of the arcade facilitator, only there is bonus point added. Rest all things are same. And except one more thing, I will tell you about it. So, basically here you can see the level games, the trivia games. And now the skill badges. For every two skill badge you complete, you get one arcade point, right? So, this is basic structure. Now, many of you are asking that I am not enrolled in the Arcade Facilitator program. If I complete the lab free courses, will I get any points? So, the answer is no. This lab free courses are only for the Arcade Facilitator participants. So, do not complete the lab free courses. You can complete the Arcade Games, Trivia Games and Skill Badges. So, basically, 
if you want to just get a point roughly idea basically the point idea so here you can see for basically if you complete 12 games you get 12 points for 8 ga trivia games you get 8 points and for skill badges we get 26 points so all the point matrix will be same up to here up to skill badges okay from milestone and bonus points you can remove it because you are not eligible for the bonus point because you are not subscribed to the arcade basically the arcade facilitator from enrollment form to be more precise so you will get points based on this the number of game badges you earn the number of trivia badges you earn number of skill badges you earn in 2x for skill badges okay so here basically how will you achieve the points so basically each month there will be 11 points you'll be getting 10 games out of which you'll achieve 11 points so basically here you can see how many games are live here four games okay we are just including the trivia also because if you have not participated in the arcade facilitator program this trivia level games all will counted as a single only if you don't know how it will be counted for that i have already shared a sample arcade insider email video okay you can just check that video also because i have explained there also and i am explaining here also where is the video let me share so i will link this video okay you can watch it regarding the point how points are calculated for normal arcade not arcade facilitator program also our new video for the point calculation will be live soon basically the confusion regarding the arcade insider and arcade facilitator program so this was basic thing i wanted to share in between now here you can see four trivia games are live and one two three four 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 eight games are live okay we are getting eight points right now here one more game is live and it will be ending on 19th so in case you haven't completed it complete it all the solutions are shared in the description box you can click on, on the basically the master sheet for all the lab free courses and skill badges if you participated in the arcade facilitator program i am saying this because many of you are commenting same things again so i am covering both things but this video is specifically for the arcade program so here you can see you can complete these points so 4 plus 4 8 and here we get two points that is 10 okay now one more game will be live that is arcade certification zone and one more game work meet play but in work meet play there is no surety of getting points like you need to be in top 50 to get the points so we are leaving that game except all will be counted like we'll be having 11 points every month so we can see that if this 11 month sorry 11 points we have earned in the august month similarly for the september month and similarly for the october and november and then we'll be having in december also right so here you can see you can achieve more and more points in the tenure so let me tell you the basic thing okay so here i can share so basically we'll have the 33 points okay so 33 points we'll be having so if you count from the uh, august itself okay so he'll have august 11 points then september 11 points then october 11 points and then november 11 points and then december 11 points sorry it will be 55 okay it will be 55 because the game will be ending on december so you'll be getting 55 arcade points if you start from now and if you have participated in july itself you'll be having 66 arcade points with only arcade games okay you heard it right only with arcade games will have 66 points if you started from july but i am considering you are new and you want to participate from the august itself so you can start from now because all the games are already live i will recommend to start from the future ready games because it will be ending on 19th and we have very less time so you should start from this only so according to august we'll have 55 arcade points now so for the basic tire i think earlier it was 20 arcade points right for the basic tire it was 20 40 65 uh, 75 85 like this point matrix was there okay like this point system was there so basically uh, if the video is there i will show you do not worry about it let me see the point system i think here i have already updated a video do not worry i will show you everything over here swags okay let me see this video i think so 
So basically in this video also I've shared how you can calculate the points based on the basic tires. Okay. Uh, so if the video is not loading, do not worry. Let me cover the main thing over here. So basically we have covered the 55 points including the August till December. Now you want to complete more points. Like if you want to reach 85 points and you are not enrolled in the Arcade Facilitator program. How you will do? So as you know that Two skill badges give one point. So, we need to have, suppose if you want to have 85 points, in that case, you have to do 60 skill badges. Okay. So, in that case, you have to do 60 skill badges. And I think the video is not loading. Let me see. Yes. Here is the price tire. I think so. Let me show you. Actually, the video is a little bit buffering. So, I will show you. Do not worry about it. Yes, yes, yes. So, here you can see this is our previous cohort price tire. So, basic tire was of 20 points and 40 points and then 65 points and 75 points. So, we are expecting 5 to 10 points increment in these milestones. Like either the first milestone will be 25 or 30. Similarly, for the legend, it will be 85 or 90. So, seeing this, you can target it. So, as I said earlier that we are getting 55 points till December from arcade games only. And for the remaining points, right? For the remaining points, like if you are targeting 90 points, okay. So, you have to do 70 skill badges, okay. 70 skill badges for compensation. And how will find the skill badges? You have to just come to this video. Basically, the video which I have shared, and here you can see the pre assessment skill badge sheet. And one more skill badge sheet is here, I think so. Yes, discover new skill badge sheet. So, basically, here you can see you can just complete these 20 skill badges and you'll be getting 10 arcade points, right? So, you here basically you have to complete only one labs and you'll be able to get the badge without any issue. If you complete all these badges, basically the labs here we have to just complete one lab if you don't know how you have to complete let me show you a demo you have to just open this and from here you can see the pre assessment thing is here you have to just click on start challenge okay you have to just click on this start challenge and you'll be redirected to this challenge lab and you have to just complete this challenge lab and get the entire badge without any issue so how will find the solution just next to it the video solution is here you can watch it and complete the badge without any issue so here we got 10 points basically we got 10 points now for the 25 points you need to do 50 skill badges okay so basically here is the skill badge sheet you can see here all the solutions are available over here more than 50 plus skill badges are here so if you face any issue you can move to the next skill badge also so this is the main thing i wanted to share that if you have not participated in the arcade fa facilitator program you can normally participate in the arcade program like this and win swags now here one more important thing i wanted to share suppose if you are targeting the 40 points only so in that case you can just complete basically in that case you can just complete up to the november points and if you face like if you are having 40 points by november so basically you'll have 44 points by november if i make any calculation mistake you can comment down below also so we'll have 44 points and basically if they don't increase the prime basically the point matrix you will be able to get the trooper tire but if they increase you have to just complete the more badges like if they increase 40 to 50 you can just complete 11 into 5 basically the up to december you can just complete the 50 points or 51 points you can leave the five games which can be any games okay you can complete trivia also and you can just complete the arcade games also like this you can complete it so basically the motive of this video was to make you understand like you can complete the arcade games like this only which will be hosted each month basically the august game will be expiring on august only they have mentioned the deadline also like for this special game it will be ending on 19th of august and regarding all the remaining games will be ending on last month basically last week of august okay maybe 30 or 31st depending on the month so you can just check it out for solutions the master sheet is already present in the description if you face any issue you can let me know in the comment section so let me summarize the video basically if you have participated in the arcade facilitator program it's well and good complete and win bonus points for that also the master sheet is there 
complete it, complete with skill badges, arcade games, pre-assessment skill badges. And if you have not participated in the arcade facilitator program and want to win swags, do not worry. Here you can just participate in the arcade program and just complete all these games. All these games will be hosted. For solutions, you can just check the channel playlist and complete it. All the points will be covered over here. And I hope it clears your basic doubts. If you have any other doubt, you can comment down below. I'll answer all your queries. And that's all about this video. Thank you guys. Have a great day.